I welcome you all to the month of May, the month of blessings, the month of prosperity, the month of fruitfulness. In this video, we are going to pray for the fruit of the womb. Remember, here in Tochi Fertility Channel, I teach women how to calculate their ovulation, how to calculate their circle, how to prepare themselves for conception. And I also include prayers because I believe in God Almighty. I believe that God is the giver of children. According to his words in the book of Psalm 127 verse 3, it says, Children are the blessings from God. They are the real gift from God. So in this new month, if you like, don't watch this video. Click and go and type Amen. Listen to this wonderful prayer that I want to render to every trying to conceive mother in this month, May. This year, 2023, will not pass you by. According to his words in the book of Job, 22 verse 28 it says decree you a word and it shall come to pass i decree today first of may 2023 that every woman any woman that is believing in god that have been trying i don't want to know your condition i don't want to know what you have been diagnosed with that because the heavenly father is the greatest physician he healed all our diseases. He created us. He knows every of our worries. Before we ask, he already knows what our problem is, but he just gave us that opportunity to ask for anything. According to his word again in the book of Matthew chapter 7 verse 7, he said, ask and it shall be given to you. Knock and the door will be opened. Seek and you will find. Today, 1st of May, 2023, I join my faith together with you that is watching this video, with, with you that will share this video, with you that will recommend this page to any woman trying to conceive that today, beginning the 1st of this month, you will conceive. You will conceive, I decree, I took authority in his word. In the book of Job 22 verse 28, he said we shall decree and it shall come to establishment. I decree that every woman in this platform, outside this platform, that have been trying to conceive, that God Almighty, through his words, he said, instead of his words not to come to pass, let heaven and earth come to pass. I also pray for every woman that have a block tube, every woman that have PCOS, polystic ovarian syndrome, every woman that have hormonal disorder, every woman that have uterine fibroid, especially submucosal fibroid that is preventing your fertilized zygote to implant successfully in the uterus. Any man that have low sperm count, low sperm motility, by the authority in the word of God, I decree that today all these emails will disappear and you will become pregnant. Yes, we should not be ignorant of the uh, principalities and power. Therefore, I take authority in the word of God again in the book of Jeremiah, it said that whatever we uproot here on earth shall be uproot in heaven. Thereby, I stand by this word to come against principalities and powers that is blocking you, that is stopping your womb from conceiving a child anywhere they are. Surely, according, according to the book of Isaiah chapter 54 verse 17, it said that no weapon formed against you shall prosper. No weapon formed against your fertility. No weapon formed against your conception. No weapon formed against your prosperity. No weapon formed against your ability to conceive this month shall prevail. The word of God will be fulfilled in your life. Have you been trying for so long? Have you been diagnosed with any ailment? God is not man. God do not follow protocol. He is everlasting God. All powers belong to him. He does what he says. Anything that comes out from God's mouth must be fulfilled. He said, instead of my words not to come to pass, let heaven and earth 
come to pass. Therefore, you that is watching me, you that have been following me, are you a believer of God? Have you given your life to God? Do you even believe that God can give you a child? Do you even believe that God will heal you? If you are not a believer of God, if you have not accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior, my dear sister, my dear brother, you need to do that because you cannot ask something for somebody whom you do not know. Therefore, ask God that you accept him as your Lord and personal Savior. And also, faith plays vital role. Remember the story of the bleeding woman in the Bible. She believed, she decided and she believed she had faith, strong faith can conquer. Even God said this, that even if our faith is little as mustard seed, that we can move mountain. Do you believe or is it because your doctor have told you, oh, you have a block too and there's no how you can become pregnant naturally except through assisted reproductive system, which is IVF. Or have you been told that you have PCOS? Oh, women with PCOS, they cannot become pregnant again. They are womb be spoiled. Do you believe in those things? Or do you believe rather in God that have all power? Do you believe rather in God that healed our disease? I am believing testimony. I have experienced God blessing. And that is why I am bringing it to you. If you believe in God, if you put your trust, your faith in God, you will prevail in all situations. So today, being the 1st of May 2023, shall be the shall be the month of your breakthrough shall be the month of restoration shall be the month of healing i am not a pastor i am not a prophetess but i am a daughter of god who believes in god who whenever i ask anything from god he do it without condition you go to your pastors other gods most small gods they would demand for something but god is not demanding for anything god heals you and sets you free and the why I like God's healing is that if God heals you, he will heal the cause of your problem. Because they may heal you and later this image will surface again. But the Most High God heals you. He will heal the causes of those problems. You will be free totally. So my dear brothers and sisters, today I just want to decree this. I am not here today to teach, but also to tell you that God in his infinite mercy, the God of fertility in Tochi Fertility Channel is going to wipe away your tears. I am not exaggerating. I am not boasting, but this is the reality. Anybody who believes in God, anybody who takes faith in God, this will happen to you this year. In fact, this month, today is a force. So you have chances, you have opportunity. I don't want to know your condition. I don't want to know what you are suffering from because my God do not follow protocol. So I decree to you today that your womb will hear the word of God. Your womb will be submissive and conceive a child. So sing this song. Oh Lord, I want to see your glory. I want to offer the sacrifice of praise. Tell God that you want to see his glory so that you will offer to him the sacrifice of praise. Oh Lord, we want to see your glory. We want to offer the sacrifice of praise. May God answer your prayer. May this month be a month of testimony upon you and your household. Go and put your trust in God. You will conceive and give testimony to God. I love you all. Bye-bye.